There was a more serious story uh, through the week, and again in the paper, uh, and that was to do with the North Grenville Police Services Board and the new OPP contract. Uh, as you may know, the, the policing contract that we have in North Grenville is one of the largest items in the budget. Uh, it's, it costs us a great deal of money to have OPP policing services here. And the police services board are mandated under provincial law to, to monitor mm. the implementation of the contract, to keep an eye on what's been going on, staffing levels, activity, this kind of thing. And most recently, at their most recent meeting, the police services board themselves uh, had to ask questions of the OPP about what exactly is involved in the contract. Um, the whole contract template was reorganized for this, uh, for this new period. And there seems to be um, confusion about what exactly what they call the base services are. In other words, what are we getting for our money? The, the board were very careful to say we're not complaining about the cost, although some of us would. <laughs> um, so it's not a matter of the cost, it's just a matter of we don't know exactly what we're getting for the money. Right. Uh, do we have the same number of officers that was, we had in the last contract? what services are covered under this, because one of the really expensive parts of any uh, OPP budget uh, for a municipality are the calls for service. We, and, and that means that the contract itself covers certain things, certain kinds of calls and certain kinds of services by the police. But then there's another list of things that they can do that they pay, we pay for on a per call basis or whatever. And there doesn't be any clarification, there doesn't seem to be that clarification uh, for the board about this contract and what's covered and what mm -hmm. isn't and all that kind of thing. So they were asking for, for information about this. And at one point they were ready to call for a full review of the contract wow. to try and find out because the answers they were getting from the OPP were not satisfactory. Mm. However, what, what has happened is that the OPP uh, inspector for the area, Bill Bolton, has agreed that at the next police services board, which is this week, he'll provide a report, hopefully giving some more clarification on this. And it's a serious issue for the police board because the members, who are volunteers, at the same time, because they're mandated under provincial legislation, they have legal responsibilities for this monitoring job. And they felt they couldn't do their job properly unless these things were, were answered, unless it was clear what exactly they were supposed to be looking at. Yeah. So the, the expectation is that uh, Inspector Bolton's report this week will provide that clarification and give us some idea of what precisely it is yeah. we have covered in the contract. So perhaps in next week's paper we'll have a follow-up on this and we'll be able to answer some of those questions. Yeah, but at good. the moment it's hanging there, it's a serious issue for everybody. Definitely. Yeah.